Tonight, the town of East Longmeadow held their first school committee meeting after voting to not mandate masks this fall. The meeting comes ahead of a state meeting set for tomorrow that ultimately may override the town's decision. Western Mass News reporter Lindsay Kane live for us in East Longmeadow with those details. Lindsay. Chris and Jordan, parents spoke out in tonight's meeting for over an hour. A pretty even mix of parents in favor of the committee's decision and parents who were against it. But tomorrow, East Longmeadow may have a mask mandate after all. That's the reason why we need to wear masks. Because we are going to intermingle our students with children that have parents that are conspiracy theorists. A mixed reaction in an East Longmeadow school committee meeting Monday night. The first meeting since the town voted to not mandate masks in schools. Parents speaking out for over an hour, an even mix of those against the decision and those applauding the committee. They don't complain. They understand what this looks like. The number of COVID infections are rising rapidly across the country and in Massachusetts. We are the second most vaccinated state in the country, and it is happening here in our backyard. Massachusetts was basically the beginning of freedom and choice. The board, I think, got this right. I think they left the choice, the decision, in the hands of the parents. They're not telling people that you're not allowed to wear masks. If you feel strongly about it, please send your kids to school in masks. A petition in hopes of reversing the committee's decision landed more than 700 signatures. While the committee didn't reverse their decision, those parents still have one more chance to see the outcome they've been pleading for if the state steps in. The Board of Elementary and Secondary Education is set to vote Tuesday to determine whether Education Commissioner Jeffrey Riley should have the authority to issue the mask mandate for at least the month of September, a mandate that would override East Longmeadow's decision. I just wish that the people we elected in East Longmeadow for the school committee listened to the doctors instead of waiting for the commissioner to make the decision. Others are holding their breath, waiting on the state, adamant a mask mandate is not best for young students. My little grandson has anxiety. He has asthma. He, he does not like masks. He can't breathe. He don't understand why we have to wear masks. The state's meeting is tomorrow at 10 a.m. to vote on whether Commissioner Riley has the authority to mandate masks or not. Be sure to stick with Western Mass News both on air and online for the latest information. Live in East Longmeadow, Lindsay Kane, Western Mass News.